I35Equipment.com. Today we're in the Cat Builder 308E2 CR Hydraulic Track Excavator. We're going to go through how to operate your hydraulic gear attached system. We have dropped the safety lever and we are in working mode. All we're going to do is go to this little button selector here. It looks like your hydraulic quick attach. Push that. You're going to hit unlock wedge. It's going to start a timeout. And you've got, or sorry, you can lock or unlock the front. Right now you should be, sorry, I'm going to do one handed here. Just bear with me. We're going to unlock. We're going to unlock the front. You've got 10 seconds from now to actually unhook and leave the bucket on the floor, on the ground, I mean. Bear with me so you can see this. There it is. Now, pretty much similar thing, just working backwards if you want to hook it up. I'm going to bring this up here, though, so you can see it. Again, we're going to hand it, so just bear with me. We're going to lock it. And all you see is... Or all that's happening there is you're locking that wedge back against the back of the head. So currently we are locked up. You see the front is going to be locked. That's that little uh, tab that comes down, and the back is going to be that tab that comes back across the back pin. All right. So let's go ahead and go through it without the bucket on here, so you can see what we're looking at, so you know what you're doing. All right. So we're going to zoom out here a little bit. We're going to hit this. We're going to unlock the wedge unlock the front at the same time as we're curling the tab did come out but the bottom didn't so let's just verify here so we're gonna say there we go just need to be fully curled to actually unlock so we are going to you see the, the back is fully unlocked there now we're gonna unlock the top by just saying unlock front fully curl red tab has tipped up. So we're not going to have enough time to do this one-handed, so just bear with me. We'll uh, let it cycle through and then we'll start over. We're going to get this guy down exactly where I need it to be. So we're going to unlock the front. We've got 10 seconds to grab it with the front. Full curl. When it's full curled, you can then hit. So we're already locked on the front automatically. But we're gonna, after that 10 seconds, we're going to lock that wedge back up on on the uh, back pin or bottom pin by giving it a little hydraulic pressure and hitting that lock button. You see here now, it's not going to have any play. If it weren't locked, the back, of course, would be tipping down. So, hope that video is beneficial to you. Always consult your operator's manual. Don't ever do this with anyone hanging around or in an unsafe area. Give yourself plenty of room. If you have any questions, consult your operator's manual. You can always see our full and update inventory consignment heavy equipment online at www.i35equipment.com. Check out our other videos for other pattern control.